Hi, it's Terry Edwards here, Renegade Recruiter, and we work with the owners and directors of an independently owned recruitment and service firms. We share with them how to generate more leads, how to scale the business, how to increase their personal income. So I'm going to share a quick story with you. I've just got off the internet, um, just looking to book some holidays for the family for this summer. And if you're a parent, you'd be aware of this, um, this phenomenon is, but that if you book your holidays outside the school holidays, it's a lot uh, cheaper than if you book it during the, during the school holidays. And there's a lesson in there if you're an owner or director of a recruitment search firm and you want to get higher fees. Because it's a basic law of supply and demand. I mean, that same law of supply and demand applies to anything. So if you look at luxury brands, you're probably well aware uh, that luxury brands will reduce their supply to maintain a high price. Theme parks is another great example. A theme park will have a capacity as a number of visitors it can take. So on high demand days, their prices will increase. But on low demand days, let's say lousy weather or, or during, during school term, um, their prices actually go down. And this is good news for you if you're an owner or director of a recruitment to search business and you're having challenges with your fees and you're in a market where it's a candidate driven market. This is really good news. So why a candidate driven market is really good news for you as a recruitment and search for managers. This, this is basic um, e e econ economics just from, from the share of the to you. It's called market forces or supply and demand. So if there is a, a rise in supply of, of, of candidates, there's a high uh, amount of candidates, but there's a decline in demand, if you combine those two, what it means is that the fees that you're going to get are actually going to go down. And uh, certainly during a recession, that's what tends to happen. And the smart recruiters uh, know that. However, the good news is, if there's a, 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 a fall in supply of good quality candidates and, the, and it's a candidate-driven market and hiring managers are having problems finding good quality candidates and there's an increase in demand for these good quality candidates, what that means is that your fees will go up. So yeah, a hiring manager can't say to you, yes, I know there's a shortage of good quality candidates. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm only going to pay you 14%. We're only going to work on contingent and I'm only going to pay you after 90 days or anything as equally ridiculous as that. Because from your point of view, logic dictates, why, would, why on earth would I work with you when there's a, there's a, there's a shortage of candidates? Why would, why would you do that when you could work with a client who understands the whole economics and appreciates that, if anything, they're going to have to pay a high fee, not a low fee, if there's a shortage of candidates. Now, I know as a concept, it's, it's relatively easy when you look about the, the law of supply and demand. And I know if you're listening to this right now, you go, well, that kind of makes sense. And although it's, it's quite simple, it's not always easy to Im implement into your business so you can get higher fees. So if you're an owner or a director of a recruitment search firm and you work in a candidate-driven market, and you're having real challenges now getting the fees that you deserve and getting the business that you deserve. Simply send me a personal message and I'll get something to you. I'll get a cheat cheat sheet to you or something 